In Baltimore, police officer, sergeant, indicted in connection with allegations of assault involving a juvenile. Baltimore City Grand Jury yesterday indicted two members of the Baltimore City Police Department. According to the Baltimore City State's Attorney's Office, Officer Maxwell Dundor and Sergeant Brendan O'Leary both face charges in connection with the assault of a juvenile. These charges stem from allegations that Dundor was investigating a report of a stolen vehicle last year, last spring, April 2020, when he slammed a 17-year-old boy face down onto the concrete. According to prosecutors, the boy identified as Bobby Jones was getting out of the driver's door of the reported stolen vehicle and tried to run away. Prosecutors say that Dundor grabbed Adams, lifted him off the ground, and slammed him face down onto the concrete, landing on top of Adams' back. According to prosecutors, Adams struggled to free himself, and Dundor increased the force of this hold. I swear to God, I'll choke you out if you don't stop. I will choke you. I will kill you, he said. I will kill you. Prosecutors said that the other officers arrived and assisted in securing Adams in handcuffs. Prosecutors said that Dundor pushed Adams on the right side of his face and back kicked him in the face. Per Baltimore police policy, O'Leary was required to conduct uh, and document the use of force. Now, prosecutors said that O'Leary asserted in his report that he had viewed all body-worn camera video before submitting the report. Prosecutors said that the video does not support the statements, observations, and conclusions made by O'Leary in his report. So, uh, Baltimore City uh, Police Department did release this statement saying that they are aware that two of our members... Sergeant Brendan O'Leary and Officer Maxwell Dendor were indicted yesterday by the grand jury in reference to an incident that took place on April 27, 2020 in the Northeast District. The incident involved the arrest of a juvenile who was in possession of a stolen vehicle. The Public Integrity Bureau opened an internal investigation into this incident in April 2020 and immediately referred this incident to the state's attorney's office. Both members have been suspended and reassigned to administrative functions pending the outcome of the investigation. Uh, Mayor Scott also issued a statement. Baltimore's mayor said that I am aware that two members of the Baltimore Police Department were indicted for an incident involving the arrest of a teenager last April. I'm disgusted by these allegations and remain committed to improve this culture and lack of humanity. So, um, Baltimore Police Department doing uh, bare minimum. (laughs) Uh, So, I I mean, it takes so long, it takes so long for them to conduct these investigations. I wonder if we will ever hear anything from it, I, mean, I just, I just don't know. Uh, I, I don't know. Far too often, we see situations and hear about situations like this. Um, this is called police brutality, and it is also perjury, uh, lying. I mean, they're lying. But uh, such is life. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section: Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, TikTok at the Diamond K Show.